Concordia beginning the 2013 football season at home. A sunny Saturday afternoon as the Golden Bears hosting the Minot State Beavers looking for a positive start to things and trying to get the offense in rhythm early and they would do just that. Jared Russo named the starting quarterback finding Corey Cole along the outside. Fourth and goal from the one. Ryan Williams going for it. It paid off Trey Spears into the end zone for the score. Odd formation for Concordia following that. James Peterson running it in. 4-2. It was 8-0. Concordia defense chipping in as well. Thomas Flack, Nick Yock combining for the sack on Minot State quarterback Zach Cunha and then Yock with another big hit on Cunha's blind side. The defensive front making Cunha's life difficult all day. Concordia mixing in runs and throws. Trey Spears able to get to the outside. A long run deep into Minot territory. He was busy throughout the day. And after that Spears run, crossing route over the middle. Gabe Boyce making people miss, finding the sideline. The yards after the catch, giving him a 46-yard run in the or catch for a touchdown in the second quarter. Concordia led it 15-0. Minot State trying to counter, but Nick Yock and Josh Trivenov stopping Zach Cunha in his tracks. Yock had a big day from his linebacker spot. And Rafael Washington over the middle, the Concordia tight end, getting that throw from Jared Russo to move it downfield again. Wait in the second Cordia, uh, quarter, Concordia trying for another score, going deep for Cordell Smith, but it was Cooper Helm with the interception. Concordia went into halftime with a 15-0 lead. Outcome still in doubt, but Concordia would come out in rhythm again in the third quarter. Jared Russo on the run, throws off his back foot, but Cordell Smith just too tall. It was his only catch of the game, but it was a big one. 66 yards for the touchdown, and that made it 22 to nothing. Golden Bears. Zach Cunha trying to make something happen, but it's Zach Moore with his first sack of the season. Bringing him down, Cunha was sacked four times. Trey Spears on the move again, making people miss to the outside. 33-yard gain. He would finish with 100. 46 yards rushing. Injured on that play, so Ronald Zolikoffer came in and a swing pass. He shows he has the elusiveness as well, reversing the field and some good blocking downfield as well without committing a penalty. Zolikoffer in from 26 yards out, made it 29 0. Zach Cunha looking down the field late in the game. Minot trying to get a score as they went to Wayne Peters, but the fumble forced by Ryan McKee. Concordia would recover and wrap up the game 29-0. The final score, it's a season opening win for Concordia. They will be at Bemidji State next week.